Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm gonna show you how to achieve this beautifully elegant, smoky look. So let's get started. So I'm gonna start by wearing this cute headband. The very first and important step is primer. So it creates a smooth base, uh, as in a canvas for your makeup. So now I'm gonna start with correcting my face like uh, I need to conceal my dark circles and before that I need to correct the undertones of my skin and now I'm blending it with a sponge uh, very properly so that it doesn't crease out afterwards so I'm working really softly and slowly under my eyes while blending the product under your eyes you need to keep one thing in mind that you just have to dab the product Now I'm applying concealer on my eyelids. We need to cover the orange corrector as we don't want to end up looking like a monkey. And uh, yeah, and now I'm using my Maybelline concealer under my eyes and I'm gonna dab it slowly. So concealing is quite important and time consuming in my case as I've got a lot of dark circles and I'm not blessed with a perfect skin right. So for eyes I'm gonna use Morphe by James Charles. I'm gonna start by using a neutral shade first so that my makeup glides on really well on my eyelids and moreover I want the uh, pigments to pop out. So now I'm taking very light orange and working on my crease and I'm blending it really well so that there are no harsh lines. Now I'm taking brown color on my brush and I'm gonna buff it on the corners of my eyes and this is gonna help my eyes get a more of a softer look on the crease and the corners. So you gotta blend, blend and blend. So now I'm taking black color and I've already applied it on my lids and now I'm just blending it. So instead of going with an eyeshadow, you can also go with a coal or a gel eyeliner and you can just match it afterwards. Now finally I'm gonna do my base with Huda Beauty uh, foundation in shade Amaretti. So whenever I do my smoky eyes, I prefer to do my base after I do my eyes so that the product that has fallen can be cleaned. But it's totally up to you guys whatever you like to do before and uh, there is no hard and fast rule in makeup dude. MAC Studio Fix Powder to set my base and I'm gonna buff it all over my face. Now moving on to the lashes, I'm gonna do it with Color Bar Mascara and I am applying it from roots till the length of my lash so that it doesn't get clumpy. lash curler giving a nice curl to my lashes which I by the way bought from Miniso. I'm filling my waterline with the coal and yeah. Moving on to the brows I'm using 3 in 1 pencil by Miniso. You don't have to overdo your eyebrows you just need to uh, fill up the gaps and give it a clean shape. And now I'm applying blush from Maybelline Fit Me range and I'm working in the upward direction to lift up my cheekbone. It's time for my favorite part contouring. So yeah, now I'm working again, I'm working in the upward direction so that it gives a structure to my face. So now I'm giving 
a kind of a V shape to my face so I'm cutting all the excess part and also you need to blend it really well leaving no harsh lines on your face and again my favorite part is uh, highlighting so yeah time to add the final touch to my look adding a lipstick so here I'm wearing Nika matte to last in shade Janvi and you will get all the details of my products in the description box below so yeah this is it guys so this is my final look और कैसी लग रही हूँ मैं नीचे कमेंट्स और लाइक करके बताएं बाय